所写念歌，咱用咱灵来唱。主耶稣，笑脸挂，笑脸挂。主耶稣，笑脸挂，笑脸挂。主在我面，头放我一肩。主耶稣，笑脸挂。主耶稣，笑脸挂。
Cantabile is a non-profit Filipino choral group. Choral Cantabile is a Filipino choral It is composed of singers from diverse or different Christian churches. And its purpose is to share God's message of love through singing. The group is composed of conductors, music teachers, musicians, and professionals. It was founded in 2002 by Miss Sharon Abesamis. Uh, Sharon so and she was with the world renowned Philippine Madrigal singers some time back. Now, her inspiration to form a choral group is because she wants to honor and glorify Jesus Christ. The choir has traveled across the world to evangelize the good news through concerts, music workshops, and training. So Miss Sharon is the choir master, pastor, and visionary for the choir at this point of time. She holds a Bachelor of Music in Choral Conducting and Voice from the University of Philippines College of Music. She directs various choirs from government agencies and churches across the country. And she has gained a reputation as an accomplished and versatile choral director. So at this time, let's welcome Miss Sharon and the choir. So at this time, let's welcome Miss Sharon and the choir. Coro cantabile, an Italian phrase which means a choir that sings smoothly and beautifully, is a Filipino choir from different walks of life, but united in their mission to share God's love and exhibit the Filipino culture through a cappella music. In 2002, Coro cantabile was founded by Miss Sharon Abisamis, a former member of the world renowned. Philippine Madrigal Singers, with the inspiration to form a choral group that honors and glorifies Christ. Coro Cantabile is committed to sharing the gospel through soulful and uplifting performances. Their rich harmonies, stirring vocals, and testimonies of faith resonate with audiences, transcend cultural and religious barriers, and speak to the very core of human spirit. The ministry of Coro Cantabile has brought countless lives closer to embracing faith and salvation in Jesus Christ, both
both locally and abroad. The shared passion of each member has transformed them into more than just performers. They are now storytellers and ambassadors of Filipino culture. As they continue to share their gifts, let us join them on their mission, pray with them, and support their cause. Koro Cantabile, making music, touching lives, all for God's glory. Soldiers marching us to war. 
Hello, good afternoon. I'm Froilan Flores, and I'm from Labap's Church in Metro Manila. Uh, I am the operation manager in Collegio Novelty, Novelty Shop in Manila. Hello, good evening. I'm Lawrence, I'm Pastor Lawrence from, uh, well, from the Philippines. I'm serving the Lord at uh, Maranata First Evangelical Christian Church. I used to be a teacher, a mathematics teacher, but now I'm a full-time pastor and full-time husband. Magandang gabi. That's good evening in Filipino. I'm Maranatha Smith, and I work as a virtual assistant, and I'm serving the Lord in Green Hills Christian Fellowship. Good evening. I am Eliazar Tawatan, and I am serving the Lord at Malabon International Baptist Church and Jesus Christ Baptist Church. One in Metro Manila and one is in a province in the Philippines. I am an... Uh, I'm a collection officer in a bank. Good evening, everyone. My name is Praise. I am an architect, and I go to a Southern Baptist church. Taike Hoami, Ivan. So I work in the Philippines as an entrepreneur. And I serve at St. Stephen's Parish. Good evening, everyone. I'm Rika Flores. Um, I'm serving the Lord in Love Baptist Church, Kaloocan, in Manila. And I am an admin manager in Collect Zone Novelty Shop. Good evening. I'm Joshua, without H. And I'm a pastor's kid, and I'm serving the Lord in Barrio Obrero Baptist Church. Good evening, my name is Zas from Capital City Alliance Church, and I work in a bank. Good evening, I am Joshua with H. I am working as a regional marketing manager for an Australian school, and I serve the Lord at Fairview Fundamental Baptist Church in the Philippines. Good evening, everyone. I am Divine. I am an accountant and a mother of three and a mother of my husband. <laughs> and I am blessed to serve the Lord through Maranatha First Evangelical Christian Church in Quezon City. Hello, good evening. My name is Ronald. I am a, I'm a businessman and I go to church in Good Samaritan United Methodist Church. Salamat Petang. Good evening, everyone. I'm Lay Subido, and I'm a former hotelier in one of uh, five-star hotel in the Philippines. And I serve the Lord in Batasan Hills International Baptist Church. Hi, good evening, everyone. My name is JB, and I'm a virtual assistant and serving the Lord at Antioch Christian Community back in the Philippines. Magandang gabi. Good evening. I'm Teacher Eunice, serving the Lord at Kalaokan Bible Church, Philippines. Hi, good evening. Namasaya Emmer, and I work in a call center back in the Philippines, and I attend church in Victory Church of Asia. And I am Sharon Abisamis. I am a music missionary and also music director at Maranata First Evangelical Church in Manila. Our next songs, Elijah Rock and the Battle of Jericho, are spirituals that proclaim powerful messages of unwavering faith, enduring strength, and the victory of God's people. Elijah Rock reminds us of the prophet Elijah, a man who stood fir firm in his faith despite overwhelming opposition. The song calls, at, the song calls on us to shout and pray reminding us that prayer and persistence can uplift us in moments of struggle. It encourages us to stay strong 
in our beliefs and find strength in prayer and faith when facing life's struggles. Similarly, the, the Battle of Jericho recounts the biblical story of Joshua and the Israelites bringing down the walls of Jericho through faith and determination. This song reminds us that even when obstacles seem too great to overcome, faith and perseverance can lead to miraculous breakthroughs. The walls in our lives, whether they are fears, doubts, or struggles, can also come down if we face them with courage and unwavering belief in our God. May these songs inspire us to meditate on the strength of faith, the value of perseverance, and the powerful and the power of fellowship in overcoming trials.
Good evening. <coughs> Praise God for the songs we have sung. This time, we will bring you to a fascinating journey of imagination and awe. We will drive you into a world of wonder where dreams take flight and laughter fills the air. From the depths of the ocean to the sun-kissed savannas of Africa, these beloved Disney songs take us on an amazing journey. These songs remind us of the beauty of nature, the power of friendship, and the importance of embracing life's simple joys. Whether we're singing about a carefree lifestyle or the circle of life itself, these songs inspire us to dream, to hope, and to believe in the spark within us all. Sing along with the fishes, kings, in each great or small on the endless round as we celebrate the beauty of the wonder world around us. Let go of your worries for the rest of your days. Let it be problem-free. Make that your philosophy. And if it works, well, what can we say except you're welcome? Mm-hmm. 
Filipino songs. One is a folk song titled Pamugun, means sparrow or burung pipit, delivered brilliantly in a language called Magindanao. It is a conversation between a sparrow and a hunter. The next song was popularized by Freddy Aguilar, titled Anak, means child. This song is about the everlasting love of parents to their child, even in the moments wherein they are being disobeyed or rebelled against. The lesson of this song is no matter how much we push away our parents because of our obscure reasoning, we will always end up running back to them. Just like God's love for us, it does not depend on our faithfulness because it is unconditional. He loved us while he were sinners. In Romans 3, 23 says, We have all sinned and fallen short of the glory of God. We are all prodigals in that we have run from God, selfishly squandered our resources, and to some degree wallowed in sin. But God is ready to forgive. He will save the concrete, not by works, but by his grace. Ding, 
A boy asked his father, Dad, do you love me? He responded, Of course. Then the boy spread his arms. Dad, I love you, like this much. But his father says, I love you even more. How much more our Father in heaven loves us? It says in Jeremiah 3.13, sorry, Jeremiah 31.3, I have loved you, my people, with an everlasting love. With unfailing love, I have drawn you to myself. There is no greater love than this, that a king would be willing to give his life for us. There is no higher sacrifice 
that Jesus would give his life for us sinners. He paid the precious price for us, which he didn't deserve. We didn't deserve that. Our next song is a popular children's song in the hymn, Tsu Yaso Tiagua in Kitsai Ti Chiangkwa.
Our next song is popularized by Steve Green, and it is beautifully arranged by our very own Miss Sharon Abisamis. It speaks to each one of us, reminding the quiet yet power Im impact of our lives can have on others. As we face challenges and uncertainties, the song calls us to remain steadfast, trusting that our faithfulness to God can be a light to those around us. It is a prayer that at the end of our journey, we'll live in such a way that others see God's love and faithfulness through us. This song is a call to be the kind of people who inspire hope, who endure with grace, and who leave a legacy that touches hearts for generations to come and most of all, glorifying God with our lives. May we all desire that the Lord will find us faithful till we come home with Him or until He comes.
Good evening to all of you. And it is our joy to be with you tonight. Praising the Lord and worshiping the Lord, my brothers and sisters in the Lord. Just like what the song uh, a while ago tells us, may God find us faithful in sharing the gospel to all peoples of the world. As believers in Christ, we are all called to witness and share about God's greatness to those around us. I have entitled this short message, Find Us Faithful. And we can have our text from 2 Corinthians 5, 17 to 21, but I would like to focus on verse 20. Therefore, we are ambassadors for Christ, as though God were making an appeal through us. We beg you on behalf of Christ, be reconciled to God. Do you know that we are all Christ's ambassadors? That we represent Christ Himself. So there are two important questions that I would like you to ponder about. First, how do we represent Christ through our lives in, a, in our daily living? Second, how faithful are we right now in doing the tasks that the Lord has entrusted to us? So, as I said, I have only three points, and these will not take too long. And my first point is, may he find us faithful in fulfilling the Great Commission. Be faithful in fulfilling the Great Commission. In John 2021, it says, Jesus said to them again, Peace be with you, as the Father has sent me, even so, I am sending you. And this common verse, Matthew 28:19-20 says, Go, therefore, and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit teaching them to observe all that I have commanded you. And behold, I am with you always to the end of the age. So why do we need to be faithful in doing the Great Commission? Because it is God's last will and testament to us. It is Christ's final instruction. So we have to be faithfully constant and consistent in doing this. Question. How, uh, when did we last share Jesus to our friends? Just a personal check, is it yesterday, this week, 
是唔是真開，還是頂禮拜？啊 ，this month， 還是即季節？啊 ，last year， 還是舊年 ？So we must be intentional in sharing Christ to others。咱特別調啲嘢，特別刻意嘅嚟分享主嘅福音。Let us not be idle because this is God's final instruction to us. Let my heart be kept in bojo. It will tell us that you, you love it too. Love it too. It can do a lot of what I'm doing. It can do a lot. Second is that we can only do the Great Commission here on earth. It will tell us that our mission is to go to the next place. It ceases when our time is over and be with the Lord in heaven, right? 当我让伊点声过了，让对家去上地下边伊点声，让被救了。Luke nineteen ten says, "For the Son of Man came to seek and save the lost." 罗加福音第十九章第十七节，甲人讲着讲，人子来就是被找、被拯救、失丧的人。And because we are Christ's ambassadors, we are His witnesses. 一个人是主的使者，所以咱本是伊的见做见证的人。We must also seek and share the gospel so that they will be saved. Lam the be chui, lau lang the be hun hiong i ah jale hok im hoi lang e tan to tik you. And also, doing the Great Commission must be a way of life to us. Ah jale ta shi ming ni the be si wo lang ta ta jit e san wa e hong e fang si. The way we live, our testimony in word and in deed. 人阿做话咧，人阿做行出，人会生命咧，就是这里大见证来。Are being used by God in delivering the message of hope。传传掉人会生命，人会传出去这里啊，这里啊，希望啊，盼望的信息。So I also have these questions: How do we live our lives？ 我系问题，就是讲对我来讲咧，就是讲人阿做鬼，人大大只会生命。Do people see Christ in us? 人看到人一点声，有看到耶稣，到我人一生命那边播。Do our lives show that we are Christians? 人一生命，人有显出是基督徒一生命播。How do we live as salt and light of this world? 人阿在做这个世界的光，世界盐是真啊重要的。If they see us and know us, may we plant the gospel seed to them. 那是伊人看到人一点声，人本别也这里福音的秘籍，在伊人的生命的那边。Amen to that. Amen, bo. Can I hear a loud amen? Amen. Amen. Second point is that we must be faithful in doing the task that the Lord has given us. 第二点咧，咱要用心来做，我人会工作，做好我人的工作。God has given us a specific calling for His kingdom work. 一个主。大一个大那边，经算了那每一个人，个了本特别的，好让特别的工作必做。In First Corinthians twelve fourteen and twenty, for the body does not consist of one member but of many. As it is, there are many parts yet one body. 哥林多前书第十七章十四节加二十节，先故咧，唔唔是干那一个肢体呢，乃是只那只诶诶肢体。但是肢体虽然是只那只，身骨关在是只里呢。Can you tell the one beside you, I am part of that body? 假如给别处别讲，我是啊，上帝的身骨的一部分。Okay, so we, also we have to know our calling, our task, and use it for God's glory. 咱特别在讲，咱的生命，咱的工作，咱的呼召是虾米？然后咱被用来来荣耀上帝的名。We know that we are Christians, right? 咱在讲，咱每一个人是基督徒。But do we know our spiritual gifts? 咱在咱的恩赐是虾米不 ？Do we know what the Lord has given us, our role to play on? 你在上帝和你工作是虾米哦？你被做的工作是虾米不 ？So, brothers and sisters in the Lord, let us know our spiritual gifts and calling. 咱特别在咱的。属灵的护照，那本被在人的属灵的温数是虾米 ？And use it faithfully for the glory of God。那被重视咩来用？祝贺人的温数，和祝一面谈到荣耀。But just knowing our task is not enough。在我人的工作
We have to pursue excellence as we faithfully do our calling. Colossians 3:23 to 24 says, "Whatever you do, work heartily as for the Lord and not for me, knowing that from the Lord you will receive the inheritance as your reward. You are serving the Lord." Christ. So if you know how to sing, the Lord has given you good voice. Pursue excellence. Or any tasks or talents or gifts that the Lord has given you, don't do lesser. You know, uh, uh, we came from different churches. The music that you have just heard, we have been practicing years, months. Aside from their work and their commitment in their churches, we regularly rehearse twice or thrice a week. Why? Because the Lord deserves the best. Actually, we are not really singing for you. It's for the Master. Right? But we are enjoying God's gift to us. But we can enjoy God's gifts and skills that He has given if we do the hard work and the discipline to create an excellent performance and service for Him. Just like what uh, a song uh, says, I will not offer anything that cost me nothing. I place before him nothing less than my very best. And if I am called into sacrifice, it will be worthy of my Christ. I will not offer anything that cost me nothing. Okay, now you sing. Oh, I can only do this for the Lord. That's enough. But you know, we have to prioritize God. May God find us faithful in doing our task. And for the third point, we have to be faithful being Christ ambassadors. Let us stand firm in the midst of troubles. 1 Corinthians 15:58 says, Therefore, my beloved brothers, be steadfast. Immovable, always abounding, abounding in the work of the Lord, knowing that in the Lord your labor is not in vain. Colossians 
来做主的光，因为知影讲乱所为路可抓住那边呢，唔是白白的了去的。And as Christ's ambassadors, we must always seek and trust and obey God. 成为主的使呃使者呢，咱特别点点来吹，来辛苦，来顺服咱的主。When you are in doubt and in your low point. Proverbs 3, 5 to 6 is for us. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and do not lean on your own understanding. In all your ways, acknowledge Him and He will make your paths straight. When you have a doubt, when you don't know how to do it, the first one, 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 Being faithful as Christ's ambassadors means we have to magnify God with our whole being as we reach out to people. 当我们被啊做主的使者的点声来啊传福音来救灵魂的点声，咱被用全人全心来荣耀主。Reaching beyond what is just. Enough. Why beyond what is enough? This is the last point, and this is very, very important because uh, it takes application from us. Don't just hear it and enjoy, but do this. 唔是，人唔是俾佢哋听，人享受呢，但是人俾挖出来，俾做出来。Sometimes we just give and help with what is just comfortable for us。冇掉掉，人嗰阵时人做一点声，人是干嘛掉啊？方便，佢做呢。When there is a big sacrifice of time, efforts, money that threatens or shatters our comfort of our life, it's just so so hard. To do this more than enough. 但是咧，有当时人会拄到诶诶诶环境咧，就是讲到被用到人会点声，被用到人会坚持，何人何人呃未讲呃怎样会方便呢？这类就是人被所显出的。Sometimes we limit what God can do through us. 但是有当时人限制了上帝被用人所做嘅工作。When God requires more than enough from us. 当人会主要求，人所被做的是国家这点啥 ？To give glory to His name， 来荣耀伊个名。So I have these questions: How do we reach out to people who need Christ？ 所以我有这类问题，就是讲到人被阿怎来传福音，好人。How much do we help？ 人所受到对的是多少 ？How much do we give？ 人何出去的是多少？ And how well do we serve? 人诶，学晒做了有作者就好。How are we now as Christ's ambassadors? 成为耶基督、耶稣基督的使者，人做了有作好。Brothers and sisters in the Lord, we know that God is faithful. 人被再讲，人诶主是忠心的主。Always faithful. 一直信实的主。He never fails us. God is so so good to us. So what we do in gratitude for God? So we long be a joy like come on ele. Let us be faithful. 就是讲，就是讲到，咱被忠心，对台主正忠心。In serving God. 来服侍伊。Doing the Great Commission. 来做这个大使命。And representing Christ every day of our lives. 来，多人的大大节的生命，生活那边来代表耶稣基督。God bless you all. 上帝祝福大家。
higher than the yoga spirit, a sapper Praise God for the message and for the songs that we have sung. For our last song, we greet you, of course. It's almost the season now. Merry Christmas to everyone. Earlier this afternoon, we had our Christmas tree lighting ceremony, and we are beyond blessed to join you in that annual event. The timeless melody of joy to the world is more than just a Christmas carol. It's a proclamation of hope, 
a celebration of love, and a reminder of the transformative power of faith in Christ. As we sing these words, let us not only celebrate the birth of Christ, but also embrace the joy that fills our hearts every day. May this joyous spirit inspire us to spread kindness, compassion, and peace to all we encounter. Let us all join together, hearts aflame with love, and sing with the angels, joy to the world, the Lord is come. Together the, with the choir, please remain behind. <laughs> Thank you so much. Please give them another round of applause. Hallelujah. I'm sure you appreciate their singing. Right. So on behalf of Pastor Marcus and Sister Sunny and the church, we would truly want to appreciate them. 
Right, with a bouquet of flowers. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Let's give them another hand. Hallelujah. Thank you all for coming. We appreciate all of you. <laughs> Hallelujah. ชัวร์ลังกําสาชูยาซอกิตอลุเตวลังอเนโฮลุอินชูยาเจียวลังไลโกกาจิเปงไลจินปัดลูกิเมอามวลังปุนิเทียเตียวแล้วอเนเจม